Oh my god. Well, howdy, howdy, howdy. Welcome back to Bandit Network Television. Thank you so much for tuning back in. Tonight, we are going to be talking about or continuing the discussion between Gigi Hadid and Bradley Cooper. This whole situ situation that I just came across and maybe um the last one that's catching up on the news because I didn't know that Bradley Cooper and Gigi Hadid was dating. But anywho, if you're like me and if you don't keep up with these people and if you are unfamiliar with what we do over here on this platform, my name is Isaac. Thank you again for tuning in to Bandit Network Television. Anything that I do discuss is alleged, and it should not be taken as factual information, especially when talking about celebrities and uh, tarot, right? Because reading tarot is for entertainment purposes only. So with that being said, I am curious because something does, I'm not going to lie, it, it just my personal bias <laughs> before pulling the cards, which I'm not going to be biased while pulling the cards, but uh, yeah, I, there's something off about this whole thing. And I don't know if this is just new information. This is just, <laughs> it looks like it's fairly new. <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, the rumors of Bradley Cooper and Gigi Hadid was, have been circulating since October of last year, 2023. And I'm recording this video in February 2024. But, anywho... Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and hop into this celebrity psychic reading on Bradley Cooper and Gigi Hadid. So if y'all have not already checked out the reading that some, some of you are going to be asking, well, how does Zane feel about this? Can you look at how Zane feel, feels about Gigi, Dayton, Bradley Cooper? We've already did that. And if you want to take a look at it, it will be included at three minutes, like around this time period. But we're just going to be talking about Gigi and Bradley Cooper. Spirit, what are, what are the honest energies only honest energies god spirit universe what is coming through with bradley cooper and gg hadid uh okay well What is his... Uh, he's popping up here as being a king of cups. He could have fire. He could have water in his chart. And I'm also reading this as him... I think I read somewhere where he, he co-parents... Because I believe that he has a, a six-year-old daughter that he co-parents with whoever. But this reads as him getting out of something recent. Him getting out of a relationship or ending something here recently yeah 
yeah. And again, he, he keeps on popping up here as being kings. He could have fire. He could have water. Aries, Leo, Sag, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Yeah, this feels recent to me. Yeah, this feels very recent. Okay. Uh, how does Bradley Cooper feel towards Gigi Hadid? The first time of me reading their cards, they were very <laughs> strange and questionable. Uh, it... Y'all, he is... How do I phrase this? Because I know that it's going to piss some people off. You know? He could be using her as a distraction. Allegedly. Allegedly. You know, he could be using her as a distraction... from someone else if that makes any sense I need to go get some water and I shall return I do invite you to go do the same yes y'all there's something about these cards that are very uh, questionable I'm not going to lie. How? Let me go ahead and do my research because I don't want to put my foot in my mouth. So, according to Google, um, the... Irina Shake. Irina Shake. Uh, she is a model. <clears throat> and uh, he is, she's the one that he has his six year old daughter with. And they split in 2019, it says. But they co parent with each other, so. I don't I couldn't find any anyone else that he has dated at least publicly you know we don't really know because there's a lot of things that probably go on in these celebrities lives and these famous people and they, they have a private life so you know some things they just don't want out there in the paparazzi and again all of this stuff is alleged but I'm getting that he's he she's distracting him from something uh, she's distracting him from something like she's serving as a distraction that's what I keep on wanting to say y'all there's third party written all over this Alleged, allegedly, there's something going on. <laughs> there's something that is not right within these cards. Uh, yeah, that's... Now, it, on the flip side, if I don't want to be too negative, I can... Because according to the tabloids, they're saying that Let's try to be positive, Isaac, because well, let's not try to be negative because we're reading tarot and tarot's supposed to be fun and uplifting, right? You know, the Three of Cups with this Hierophant, that can talk about the relationship leading to marriage or enhancing 
Um, according to the tabloids, that is what is happening with Gigi Hadid and Bradley Cooper. But I'm reading this as something else that's happening. <laughs> We have the Page of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune, yeah, someone is stressed out about a marriage, a union, possible third party, carrying in old baggage, old drama, I don't know how long they've I don't know spirit am I spirit am I reading this wrong or am I misinterpreting the cards or is there really something going on within their marriage no spirit is saying that there someone here is very hot and cold and one foot in one foot out that's what the energy gives and something about the number two one foot in one foot out someone here could be disappointed already or they're seeing where this is going to lead to disappointment now keep in mind anything that I say can change again this is all alleged and that's why I don't know the, before it gets to this point of the five of cups the five of cups someone doesn't want to be in the five of cups someone's going someone could just jump ship I'm also seeing this Pisces that keeps on popping up. Okay, so let's continue with the reading. What, as of right now, Spirit, what will be the overall outcome with Bradley Cooper? And Gigi Hadid's relationship. What would be, what will be the overall outcome? Is it too, oh, that's not good. Someone here could find out some news and, uh, it's, I, well, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, y'all, and I'm, I'm really, I, I'm not a hater, I'm not trying to be a hater, and I hope this does not happen, I'm not wishing this on these people, but within the cards, I cannot lie, the cards are saying this is going to end in heartbreak. Cards are saying that someone here could find out some news someone here could find out some information uh someone here could do some digging someone here could do some research on somebody or they come across something crazy in their phone i don't know what's going on here but yeah someone here is not happy and they found out something and they're deciding to put themselves first, which is a good thing. And they're going to remain single or act single. Just one more for confirmation. This page of pentacles keeps on popping up. Cycles. Yeah. Y'all, this could... This could kind of get messy I'm not gonna lie this 
could get really messy. So, Spirit is saying that it's going to end in someone finding out some news about the other person. And, uh, yeah, that card keeps on wanting to flip out. We have the Five of Swords. The Five of Swords is popping up. Yeah, someone could find out something that they're not happy about. And it could be relating to someone's past and someone's being indecisive and not wanting to make a decision and still could possibly be holding on to someone from their past or dealing with somebody from their past. And because they keep on dealing with this person from their past, it keeps on uh, hindering their current relationship does that make any sense it's, it's kind of like that one it, it's like toxic baby mama energy or baby daddy energy like you have to deal with this person and it interferes within your love life that's the energy that I'm getting from this I'm not saying that Gigi had, let me clarify before you get it twisted. I'm not saying that Gigi Hadid is doing this. I'm seeing it could be someone connected to, allegedly someone connected to Bradley's past. And I'm not trying to speak bad about his children or the mother of his kids. But, I don't know, it could just be a jealous ex. I don't know what this is talking about. But, again, we're just going to have to see. Uh, only time will tell when it comes to how things will play out. Let's go ahead and pull an oracle card. I'll be right back. So what does Spirit want? Spirit, what do you want to tell Gigi Hadid and Bradley Cooper thus far in their relationship? Alleged relationship? What are things that you would like to number four number two yeah number four and number two so we have let's see ooh we have two two for you let go of your biases. If you let your past go, it does not mean that your past will let you go. <laughs> Wasn't this just what I was talking about? Just because you let your past go, or just because you think you left someone behind, like, it ain't nothing to cut that bitch off, you know, but... She don't want to cut you off. She don't want to cut you off, bro. Like, <laughs> that that's what it is. She don't want to cut you off. Okay, let go of your biases. If you let your past go, it does not mean that the past will let you go. Someone here still has a connection to their past. Yep. Play. There's a lot of playful, fiery energy. I'm getting that it's still in the honeymoon phases. That's why I don't want to say too much about it. Still in the honeymoon phases. There's a lot of playful energy that is happening here. A new beneficial offer brings unexpected gain. 
May the most you wish for be the least you get. <laughs> okay, so may the may the most you wish for be the least you get. I don't know if that's a not so nice encouraging message, but anyways, uh yeah, y'all, that's what I'm seeing with Bradley Cooper and Gigi Hadid. If you have liked or if you have enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up or thumbs down on your way out of the dough, okay? Thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe if you want to see more of this type of content. Also, go and check out uh, other videos that feature celebrity tarot readings and other things that I discuss here on my channel as well, such as true crime and other happenings within the world. You have been listening to Bandit Network Television.